hello good morning all today in this video we are going to discuss about how to make a website page that is a web page visible only for logged in users that is if we have we have added a new page in the website and if a non-logged users act, try to access the page it should not be available for him that is we have to show the pages only for the users in the system so let's see how we can do that so before going into the video if you haven't subscribed our channel please subscribe the channel and like the videos so if i go to the audio database and you can see i have already installed the website module and suppose if i go to the website from here you can see so you can see we have right now we have different pages like a shop contact us and like that we can have a n number of pages inside our database so let's see how we can make these pages only available for the users in the system so if you take the case of the shop page that is the page where we can see all the products in the system i'll just copy this url that is there will be a controller for this page that is for entering this page there will be a controller function that is a python function in the code so i'll just copy this url that is slash shop and if i make a search inside the code so this is my code and if i come here and make search of that shop here i can see i or i can get the corresponding controller so as what i have done is from here i have copied the url that is slash shop and i have come here and i have searched it that is slash shop is searched and you can see i have searched inside the python file that is controllers are python files so i have just filtered the python files and you can see here we have got the root for that page that is i will open this and you can see this is the controller which renders that page and if i scroll down to the bottom of the function you can see here the page is getting rendered with the values from these controllers so that's not our topic right now so i'll just go here at the top of the same function so this is the function or this is the controller of the show page so let's see how we can make this page available only for logged in users so currently you can see if i log out the system that is if i log out that which will admin from here still you are able to access the show page so let's see how we can restrict that so right now you can see I have logged out the system still the page is accessible for the public user that is public user is the user user can be anyone we don't know who is that user it is a public user so for making this page available only for logged in users here Here in the controller what you can do is that here you can see an authorization auth equal to public that is once you give auth equal to public is that you are telling that what this controller does is available for public users so right now what we need is to restrict this to users so you can just give auth as user so right now when we have logged to the system and when we are accessing this page you are getting it so let's restart the service and see what happens so what i have done is for this controller i have updated the odas user so now i will restart the service so once after the service is restarted and then you try to access the uh, shop page you won't get this page unless you logged into the system so i'll just go to the home page okay that's done it will come no issues and if i again come to the shop page you can see we will be redirected to the login page that is the system is saying that you can only access that page if you are logged into the system so i can go to the contacts contact us button that's no issues and if i again come to the shop plus button you can see the system is asking us to enter the credentials that is because we have given us authorization as user that is this page is available for only users so i have to enter my password and email and password so once i done that okay you will be redirected to the show page that's fine so right now which will admin get logged in so if you again click the show page once you log into the system system won't ask you to log in again so if i click on show page again you can see the login page won't come as the system as which admin is already logged in so i'll just log out the system and if i again come to the show button we will be redirected to the login page so that's the use case of or 
equal to user so if you need to make a web page available for only logged in user you can just what you can just do is that give others user so if i make it public back to the public you can see i have just updated others public again and i will restart the service to make to get changes get affected okay the service got restarted and now if i reload the screen again you can see shop page will come so i'll click on shop page you can see it's accessible right now earlier when we have clicked on the shop page it was redirecting us to the login page so that's all about how you can make a page visible only for logged in users so let's try the same for the contact us page you can see this is the contact us page i'm not sure whether this has a controller so let me make a search inside the code find it for that if i make search for this controller there is no controllers so we cannot easily make that so if there is no any other page or if i can go to the shop and you can see shop product warranty add to cart or let's make this page if you need to make these pages i can just search that controller find it path So this is the control of that page shop card so i'll just restart the service so right now i have given us everything else back and right now shop is accessible for the public users so right now what i'm going to do is that i'm making this page that is card page available only for logged in users that is once the user select the products and if the user try to move to the cart the system will enter try to uh, system will ask to enter the credentials so i have updated the controller for the cart that is shop cart i have given the odas user so i have restarted the service and uh, let's see what happens so right now i am the shop page i'll just select some few products so i'll just select this four person desk as my product okay that's done okay this you are getting the product screen so if i click on the add to cart option so i just click on add to cart option you can see once you click on add to cart option you are direct redirecting to the login page because once you click on add to cart button system will redirect us to the page shop cart so once system check that shop cart page has to be visible only for logged in users so that's why system is asking us to enter the credentials so once after the credentials is entered you will be redirected to the cart page itself you can see from here you can process the checkout so that's all about how you can make a web page visible only for logged in users that is just give auth equal to users sorry auth equal to users user in the corresponding controllers and if you need to the same page available for all the public users you can give auth as public so that's all about how you can restrict a page to a user or public so if you like our videos and if you feel that our channel is fair good you can just subscribe the channel and you can just click on the bell icon for notification thank you